What's up, everybody? I'm Sniggenhoff, and we are back playing EU4 once again, and I've got a lovely bunch of coconuts. Dee -dee -dee. We're playing Congo today. In the last episode, we did stuff. I can't quite remember. We've still been trying to finish up this trade war so that we can get global trade to spawn. We're still slightly losing, and I don't know what to do. Um, I do have a couple of ideas, actually, about that, but we'll get to that in a second. Um, first thing, what I would like to do... Let's stop improving with Songhai here. And unpause. Portugal tells us of tea and sugar. Ungrateful natives rose up. Am I paying full price for my troops right now? No. Good. Do I have my forts mothballed? No. Not as good. I have a... Conquistador? Right now? Convert Comoros to Fetishist to protect our brethren in the Grain Coast. Is this the Grain Coast, by any chance? No. So what I'd like to do is possibly get a claim on Sierra Leone and threaten war against Norway for it. And then if they give it to me, I'll be able to declare war directly on Mali instead of having to use Mosi. And be able to take all of this juicy land that's in the Ivory Coast trade node. So that's what I would like to do. Um, I have to build up a spy network on Denmark. But I don't know about Denmark. Well, da darn it. Um. Sure. Convert Comoros to fetishists. We're already working on doing that anyway. Have costly trade embargoes, provincial unrest. Can invest in technology, and I'm waiting to do that until we uh, embrace the printing press. And Kilwa has high liberty desire, although it would mostly go away if I stopped them from diverting trade. But if I stop them from diverting trade, we lose a lot of power, lose a lot of value in the Ivory Coast trade node. So I don't want to do that either. This is worth 30.7. This is worth 32. Jeez, that jumped up a ton. The other thing I was thinking about doing was maybe, like, embargoing the Chesapeake trade node over here, but I'd have to discover it first, and I'd have to go exploring for that. Although, I mean... That is doable. Man, I could build a lot more ships, I just don't have any sailors for it. Come back to here for a second. I mean, it just may not happen, is part of the thing. I've tried really hard for it to happen, but it may not be in the cards. Okay, there's a few places I need you to explore. American East Coast is one of them. Protect trade. The Ivory Coast. How much trade power did we lose from stopping protecting trade? Uh, nothing right now because it hasn't ticked over in the month. We lost about 25%. That'll go back up once we go back to collecting trade, but... Or protecting trade, yeah. Uh, about 15, 18% maybe. 30.9 versus 31.9. Um, okay, so I can't fabricate a claim here, is what you're telling me. I could no CB war them, but that doesn't seem great. And I can't fabricate claims, or I, like if I had a C zone connection with them, I could declare war on Molly, but I can't do that either. So. We do have a disaster taking up. I should probably take care of that at some point. 1597, and this will spawn in 1598, I'm sure. 1596. Okay, so I do need to revoke a province from them. Uh, outraged countries, sure. Give me back this 213, I guess. So 
Does anyone else who has a lot of power in this trade know that I can embargo? Utrecht, but I don't know about them. Hess, I don't know about them. France, but I don't want to make them mad. I'm going to have to go to a war with Morocco at some point. Do you have claims on Yao? Is our truce with Yao up? No. No, it is not. Is our truce with Songhai up? No. And is our truce with Mali up? Yes. But Mosi over here... Ooh, they do have a claim. I could declare war on them. And I would very much like to. Let's raise that army maintenance back up. Do you have any allies? Nope. Let's wait for them to get into position. No, no reason to declare it quite yet. Gonna have to feed a ton to Mosi, but that's fine. They should stay loyal. Three out of three. I could start annexing air. Do I have just uh Yeah, I don't have uh annex subjects anymore. Although I do kind of want my diplo points, but I'm going to have to use them at some point anyway. This truce comes up in like 11 years. Yeah, let's go ahead and start annexing them. Just so we'll have a bit less, like, overall vassal stuff, you know? That'll be done in eh, a while. Technical term, a while. And let's go ahead and declare the war. I'm going to pay some dip for this land as well. Everybody jump in there. Let's see if we can just take them out. And stack wipe. Fantastic. Do they have any more troops left? Nope. Friends in need, the queen of our illustrious king, Poco, has recently brought us a request from her family, the house Mugo, Mugo of Mosi. Apparently Malik Tugri Adi is in dire need of money and has asked us, his most trusted friends, if we can contribute in any way. His letter is filled with compliments on our great economy. We lose 250 ducats, but their opinion of us goes way up. I mean, 250 ducats is a lot, but I kind of want Mosi to like me. Great Britain has announced me as, has announced me as a rival. Well, I will rival you back. That'll cause me to have one less, uh... One less, uh... Bad embargo. Oh, can't add it while we're at war. Uh, spare no expenses, please. Myself. I can't take their whole country. I want all this that's in the trade note as well. Hmm. A little less border gory. Mali, Songhai, Yao, and Morocco. But none of those guys are going to be able to join the coalition. And if Morocco wants to declare a war on me separately without bringing in the Ottomans, I am down.
What tech level, tech level are they on? 15, and I'm on tech level 14, I believe. Tech level 12. Ooh. Ooh. That's not great. We're not ready to fight Morocco quite yet, but they should jump in the coalition. Truce of Songhai is up. Um, so who would be in this coalition? Songhai, Yao, and Morocco. Should I go just declare war on Songhai right now? Can I declare war on Songhai? Yes. Just to make sure that we'll have a truce with them. Chesapeake Bay trade node look like? Most of it's flowing up here, and then it flows to France. Actually, Great Britain isn't getting a lot from this. I shouldn't quite take so much. Morocco would not be in the coalition here. Where would they join? Not there. There. Let's just take the Ivory Coast stuff, then. That seems fine. We can peace out for that right now. Actually, you guys just stay over here. Fort rebellions and whatnot. We've gained the Holy War against Norway and Mali. Now could I threaten war for that province? Nope. No, I could not. I could start converting the stuff I can't core. We need to get back up in military tech real soon.
it getting a little more sailors each month. How we doing on institutions? 10% here, 45% here though. And that's the one we're really worried about. So we're getting there, getting closer. Twenty-eight point five. You took a dip. Is it because I'm at war? Twenty-nine point three. Now you're coming back up. English Channel's at thirty-one. Sevilla's at thirty-nine. I could try to come, like, pirate the Caribbean. And there's ten ducats flowing that way. The thirteen colonies are claiming my provinces. Okay. People flee to the colonies. The que our quest for the New World has opened up opportunities for people in our colonies. The continuing war has convinced many of the best and brightest that the time to take these opportunities is now. 300 population in Liga or gain 5 prestige. I'll take the 300 pop. That's fine. Um, that's not good. You have something falling off in 1599. And this will fire on six, December 1st of 1599. They fall off and fire at the same time. Hmm. Oh, but something else is falling off in 1594, so we're fine. Everything's fine. We can take another ability. Uh, have we taken all of our abilities? Yeah, religious and religious religion enforced. Aha. Um, who has claims on what over here? You have a claim over here. You have a claim here. Will this make Morocco mad? Why are we paying dip for this? S slightly? I think I'm going to go for it anyway. Let's improve with Morocco a little bit. Can't do anything else there. I can probably lower maintenance some. Um, I'm doing a lot to root out corruption. Um, yeah. Take the admin. I need to probably focus military the next chance I get. Need to get caught up in that. That's way more important than being caught up in, uh... Being caught up in, um... Dip. Trust your neighbor. Although citizens are encouraged to show trust and good faith in their exchanges, the reality is in many nations that is a risk people cannot afford to take. This, however, is not the case in Congo. We have successfully stamped out corruption on so many levels in society. People not only trust officials to do their jobs without the extra help of a bribe, but they also trust each other more in general exchanges. This general belief in the honesty of others is the very thread from which the fabric of our society is woven, and our country is a shining example of it. Gain one stab. Fantastic. Okay, you finish exploring there. Go ahead and explore the Mediterranean. Do we know about the Lubeck node? Not really. Do we know about Denmark? No. I'd have to explore the coasts. Hmm, well, can I cancel that mission? I 
apparently I can't cancel their mission. Um, any good marketplaces to build? Not fantastic. Not great sailor places either. What about manufactories? I need a manufactory here. What's your what's the trade good here? Slaves, and that is I think the one that we don't have. Yeah. This one requires dip tech, everything else requires admin. Point three five, point four eight, point two one, or point two one. Build one of those. Eight years away, how we doing? Thirty one versus thirty one and twenty eight. What's Genoa at? Eighteen. Very, very close. 31.01 versus 31.06. <sighs> None of these are worth more, are they? No. Ooh. Gulf of Aden is close. Jeez. Send somebody up there to transfer trade. No, 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 I did something. I did something wrong. I just sent two people there on accident. Hopefully that doesn't mess anything up. Okay. Still transferring from Zanzibar. Still transferring from here. I need to transfer from Timbuktu. There we go. Let me let them let a couple months tick and see how that does. Liga has become self-sustaining. Fantastic. And I need to colonize this province because it's in a state of mine. Where are my colonial armies at? I guess this one was one. Yep. Ethiopia is no longer a valid rival. Well, I eclipsed them at least. Oh, reminds me. Need to rival Great Britain, and I can also rival Morocco, but I think I want to wait. I will do it at some point, but I think I want to wait a little bit. All right, now what does trade look like? Transferring four ducats there, 17 ducats there, 21 ducats there for 31.9 versus 31.4 and 29.0. We should be the highest value trade node. It doesn't show we're the highest value trade node. How are we not the highest value trade node? 31.9. Even shows we're the highest here. Maybe the... Like, there's no way that something else is higher valued. Unless it's, like, in freaking China. I don't know. We'll do some more exploring, maybe find out, but... For now, thank you guys so much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, feel free to hit that like button down below, as well as subscribe to the channel, and leave me a comment. Is it just bugged? Or is there, like a 40 trade node over in China right now that's going to just screw me. Anyways, once again, thank you guys so much, and I will see you next time.